all the feels. Hi, my friends. We've been learning how to check in with your body and calm down when you're having strong feelings. So now I'm going to show you a picture of a boy named Kenny, and we're going to try to guess what feeling he is having. So put on your attentoscopes and let's see. This is Kenny. He was playing with his favorite toy, but another boy grabbed it from him. Can you guess what he's feeling? Yes, he is angry. Everybody gets angry sometimes. Doing hurtful things when you're mad, like hitting, kicking, pushing, or calling people names is not okay. When Kenny is angry, his face feels hot, his heart beats fast, and the muscles in his arms feel tight or tense. Now, pretend you are mad. Show me what your face and body looks like when you're angry. Focus your attention on your body. Can you tell yourself what parts of your body feel tight? Is it your shoulders? Is it your face? Or how about your fist? When Kenny had a strong feeling or anger, he remembered to calm down. Now, let's practice using the calm down steps. Do you notice Kenny started with the first step of calming down? He put his hand on his stomach and he said, stop. He named his feeling, I'm angry. The next is putting his hand on his stomach and feeling his belly rise and go down as he took his three belly breaths. Remember, in through the nose and out through the mouth. In through the nose out through the mouth. And the last one, in through the nose, out through the mouth. Kenny calms down. He tells the boy it's not okay to grab his toy. Kenny begins to feel better and finds a different toy that he likes. He learned about how your body feels when you are angry. Calming down when you feel mad is important so you don't act in ways that hurt other people. <laughs>